Welcome to Tax 1099. Hey guys, this video is to let you know that if you have an enterprise account, you can create different member users with different rights and functions. Uh, from your first step, if you're on the dashboard, you're going to click the settings gear here, and then you click on member user in the drop down. This is your manage members screen. If you would like to add a user, click here. You'll, you can put in the information here. Email here. Phone number if you would like. Once you choose what role they would be, then depending on what areas you want them to cover, this role here would be if you want to check specific pieces in regard to what this one does, the reviewer people you want them to do things with the 10 import data steps with the forms or provide payment also once you check these if you want to edit any of these you can just click the box here to pull some of these back to customize it If you have it the way it's you want to have it set up, once all that's in place, then you can just click add. Okay, so this member user has been added, the invitation has been sent. Once they acknowledge and click the link on the email that they've received, then you can en enable this new member user. If they don't get the invitation the first time, you can re-request here. You also have the buttons to delete here. Also, you can update any information in case it needs to be edited. If you want to totally delete this viewer or any of these users, all you have to do is click the X here. and they give you a prompt to make sure this is what you want to do. And it lets you know they've been successfully deleted. As long as you have the admin privilege, you can do this at any time with any user. All right, thank you very much for your time. Hope you have a great day. Hope you found this helpful. Thanks for watching.